Hi everyone, this is Anton from University of Maryland College Park. Today, I'm going to present our work on fast neural diffuse room impulse response generator. This work was done during my summer internship at Tencent AI Lab. A synthetic fluffy speech is created by convolving clean speech with a room impulse response and adding background noise. Room impulse responses for different acoustic environments are generated using a room impulse response generator. An acoustic environment can be described using the room geometry, speaker position, listener position, and room materials. A room impulse response consists of three parts, namely a direct response, early reflections, and late reverberations. The room impulse response generators developed over the decades can be divided into three categories. They are web-based techniques, ray-based techniques, and neural network-based techniques. Web-based approach gives accurate results by solving wave equations. However, web-based techniques are only feasible for generating room impulse responses for less complicated scenes at low frequencies. Because the complexity of wave-based techniques grows as the fourth power of frequency. Wave-based approach are less accurate alternative to the wave-based approach because the wave nature of the sound is neglected. Image method and diffuse acoustic simulators are commonly used wave-based methods in speech-related tasks. The image method only models specular reflections, while diffuse acoustic simulators models both specular and diffuse reflections. GPRIR is a variant of image method which is optimized to dramatically improve the computation speed by using GPUs. Recently, neural network based room impulse response generators are developed to generate room impulse response for a given acoustic environment. IR GAN is a GAN based room impulse response generator that is trained on real world room impulse response data set to generate realistic room impulse responses. However, IR GAN does not take conventional environmental parameters as input by design, making it less configurable than the traditional room impulse response generators. In our work, we propose a neural network based fast RIR architecture that can be directly controlled using conventional environmental parameters. A fast RIR is a one dimensional conditional generator network that is trained to generate both specular and diffuse reflections for a given acoustic environment. We control fast RIR using following acoustic environmental details. They are shoe box shape, room dimension, listener position, speaker position, and reverberation time. Reverberation time is the time taken for the sound energy to decay by 60 decibels. Reverberation time implicitly reflects the characteristics of room materials such as the floor, ceiling, wall, furniture, etc. In this example, we keep two dimensions of the listener position, three dimensions of the speaker positions, three dimensions of the room, and the reverberation time constant. We change the listener position in the x direction. We can see that when the listener approaches the speaker, the delay of the direct response is reduced over the time. The magnitude of the Direct response is partially controlled by the reverberation time. A fast RIR architecture consists of a generator and a discriminator network. A generator network takes shoebox shape room dimension, listener and source positions, and reverberation time as input and generate the corresponding room impulse response. Our discriminator network discriminates between the generator room impulse response and the ground truth room impulse response for a given acoustic environment during training. We combine the shoebox shape room dimension, listener location, and source location represented using 3D Cartesian coordinates and reverberation time as a 10 dimensional vector embedding pi a. We normalize the vector embedding within the range minus 1.2 to plus 1.2 using the largest room dimension in the training data set. For each vector embedding pi a, we generate room impulse responses using a diffuse acoustic simulator 
and use it as a ground truth to train our network. We train our network using 75,000 room impulse responses generated for medium sized rooms with room dimension varying in the following range. In the X direction from eight meters to 11 meters, in Y direction from six meter to eight meter, and in the Z direction from 2.5 meter to 3.5 meter. The objective function of a generator network consists of modified conditional GAN error, miss square error, and reverberation time error. We use the weights lambda MSC and lambda C360 to control the relative importance of the mean square error and the reverberation time error. The generator network is trained with the following modified conditional GAN error to generate room impulse responses that are difficult for the discriminator network to differentiate from the ground truth room impulse responses. We compare each samples of the room impulse responses generated using our fast RIR with room impulse responses generated using the diffuse acoustic simulator for each vector embedding pi A to calculate the mean square error. We we'll calculate the reverberation time of each generator room impulse response with the reverberation time given as the input to the network in the vector embedding pi A to get, calculate the reverberation time error. We train our discriminator network using the modified conditional GAN error. The discriminator network is trained to discriminate the generated room impulse responses using a fast RIR with the ground to room impulse responses for a given acoustic environment. We randomly select 30,000 different acoustic environments within the range of the training data set and generate room impulse responses corresponding to the selected acoustic environments using the following room impulse response generators to evaluate the performance of our fast RIR. We compare the performance of our fast RIR with room impulse response generated using image method, diffuse acoustic simulator, and GPU RIR. We evaluate the runtime of generating 30,000 room impulse responses using image method, GPU RIR, diffuse acoustic simulator, and our fast RIR. GPU RIR is optimized to run on a GPU. Therefore, we run GPU RIR only on a GPU. For a fair comparison with CPU implementation of image method and diffuse acoustic simulator, we generate room impulse responses using our fast RIR with batch size one on a CPU. We can see that our proposed fast RIR is 400 times faster than diffuse acoustic simulator on a CPU. We can see that GPU RIR performs better than our fast RIR with batch size one, which is not the real use case of our fast RIR generator. To the best of our knowledge, the GPU RIR does not support batch parallelization, while this is supported in our fast RIR. We can see that a fast RIR with batch size 64 is 12 times faster than GPU RIR. In this table, we report the reverberation time error of our fast RIR. We see that the testing reverberation time error of our fast RIR is high for input T60 below 0.25 second when compared to the input T60 greater than 0.25 second. A fast RIR is trained to generate room impulse responses with durations slightly above 0.25 seconds. For the reverberation times below 0.25 seconds, the generator room impulse responses has a noisy output between the reverberation time and 0.25 seconds. We notice that cropping the generator room impulse responses at the reverberation time improve the overall reverberation time error from 0.029 second to 0.023 second. For our FAFIL automatic speech recognition experiment, we use close talk speech data recorded using individual headset microphone and distant speech data recorded using single distant microphone from AMI corpus. We modify the CARDI recipe to take the IHM data as the training set and SCDM data as the test set. We artificially create a distance speech training data by convolving IHM data with 30,000 room impulse responses generated using image method, 
GPU RIR, Diffuse Acoustic Simulator, and Fast RIR. In this table, we present the Farfield speech recognition development and test word error rate for Farfield SDM data. We can see that a fast RIR outperforms GPU RIR by up to 2.5% absolute word error rate. The room impulse responses from diffuse acoustic simulator and diffuse acoustic simulator come to have same duration as our fast RIR performed similarly in our automatic speech recognition experiment. We can see that the accuracy of diffuse acoustic simulator and fast RIR is not significant. In summary, we propose a novel fast RIR architecture to generate large room impulse response data sets on the fly. A fast RIR performs similarly in the ASR experiments when compared to the room impulse response generator, which is used to generate a training data set to train our fast RIR. We can easily train our fast RIR with the room impulse response generator using any state of the art room impulse response generator to improve the accuracy of room impulse response generation. We would like to expand our fast RIR to generate room impulse responses for any complex 3D scenes. Thank you.